24 strangest animal taxidermy photos. Number 24, the happy cougar. Taxidermy is considered to be one of the most creepiest jobs known to man. So some of the designs by these creepy people turn out quite intriguing. This cougar seems like he will never blink during a steering contest, and you might want to give up trying to win. And you probably should considering those fangs. Number 23, slapping some paw. Don't be afraid to give this friendly bobcat a quick low five on the paw. Looks like he's been buddies with you for a while until you decide to shoot him with a bow. Everything's still cool though, no beef. Number 22, Super Squirrel. It's a bird, it's a plane. Wait, no, it's Super Squirrel. What you thought was your average squirrel who nonchalantly lived in trees, captured acorns, and even scurried across the street from time to time, turns out to be a cover for his true identity. Growing up new a nuclear power plant gave this Super Squirrel some extra powers. He's able to destroy evil wildlife, but not until the evil human villains got to him. Number 21, Chompers. Fish are known for chomping down on some bait, but who's ever fishing this guy is gonna need a really strong hook. It looks like the taxidermist put a set of false teeth, although there is a type of fish with human-like teeth known as the Paku. Number 20, Stone Fox. When taxidermy doesn't always go perfectly planned, you might end up with this eerily looking fox creature that looks like a stuffed animal nightmares are made from. The look in his eyes plus the human-like pose is enough to make you never want to go hiking again. This one here was actually sold from England to a couple in Russia for 333 pounds. It became an internet sensation and was made into viral videos in Russia, showing him in various well-known places. Number 19, Goat Maid. You might have heard of mermaids before, but have you ever heard of the goat maids? Well, if you haven't, it's probably because they don't exist. So this one here is actually a post-mortem hybrid creation. They obviously use fish, goat, and bird parts. Although it's easy to see why this would be an interesting conversation starter later on. Number 18, Cow Balloon. Once the skin is off, the taxidermist can shape or mold it in almost any way they want. This is a balloon you probably don't want to give your kid during its birthday party. The person from Hungary who designed this enjoys distorting our common perception of animals. This one here could probably be used as a beach ball in Spain somewhere. Number 17, Mythical Cat Creature. This two-headed cat seems like it's straight from a folklore of evil origins. Although many find taxidermy to be quite disturbing, you have to admit that this piece is quite intriguing to say the least. Artists like the ones who created these tend to prefer using animals who passed away from natural causes. Number 16, the Fiji Mermaid. While some taxidermist creations are meant to be artistic, others are meant to strike fear into the public and eventually convince people to pay to see it. The Fiji Mermaid was the head and torso of a young monkey that was sewn on to the fish of a tail. P.T. and Barnum's sideshow created this Fiji mermaid, and the carny folks claimed it was authentic. Of course, when people found out it was a hoax, the crowds became angry, and the exhibit was brought to an end. This goes to show you even people from the 1840s enjoyed a good hoax. Number 15, the guinea pig mobile. For those of you who are familiar with the movie Steampunk, you may understand what this is referring to. This photo features a guinea pig time machine and is quite detailed. If you are considering getting into this strange hobby or even profession, they claim mice or guinea pigs are best to start with, FYI. Number 14, the mouse mouse. Each time we're on a computer, we're normally touching a mouse, but this kind of mouse probably won't be available for purchase at your local Best Buy. This mouse was taxidermied as a mouse. As long as you don't mind touching a dead animal's skin each time you're online, this could be right up your alley. Next time you hear that mouse trap go off, keep in mind there are instructions online how to make this thing. Number 13, hey, hey, hey. This bobcat looks absolutely fabulous and seems to be posing for a selfie rather than a trophy. What seems like a botched taxidermy job actually left his mouth wide open, but turned out to be somewhat of an amusing pose. Anyone up for some Cosmos? Drinks on me. Don't you wish there were still monkeys that hang out at bars to serve you drinks? This monkey here was always the life of the party until the owner decided to have him stuffed. The service here really can't be any faster considering he has wings. Number 13, till death do us part, on God. These two squirrels fought to the death, and the loser will have to be taxidermied. Oh wait, looks like both of them lost in this case. Some people seriously seem to have too much time on their hands. Who would have thought of fencing squirrels? Number 12, more fencing mice. Why does everyone feel the need to display mice with swords? Who do they think they are, the Mouseketeers or something? Can't tell exactly what type of creatures are watching this. It might be some type of gerbil or something. We can only pray that whoever made this will find a life someday. Number 11, the cat bag. Stacy Hyduck decided to bring this unnecessary purse to the daytime Emmys in 2009, and she managed to shock many people. This faux fur paw was made from a fake cat, but it's believed that she was trying to make a statement about fur being worn at the award shows. 
According to a poll, 86% of people believe that it was a fake cat, while others believe it's too realistic to be fake. What do you think? Number 10. Gunslinging Squirrel What's a city slicker like yourself doing in a bar like this? You can really tell this squirrel wants to start some trouble. Complete with the dual revolvers, this squirrel was made to look like a true cowboy squirrel. Number 9. The Holy Mouse If you think taxidermy is a sin, you should really confess your guilty conscience to this holy mouse. Instead of money, he will accept a piece of cheese as a donation. Someone here really took the time to make a little priest outfit for him? Has the world lost its mind? Has mass insanity of the world finally arrived? This one here seems to look like it's posing for a painting or a photo shoot. Are you going to draw me like one of your French girls already, or just sit there and stare? Number 7. Lord of the Pinecone My precious. You really don't want to try snatching this pinecone away from this thing. Really hard to tell what it is, let alone not be extremely creeped out. Number 6. Cheetah Chair This one here looks like he swallowed a bench or a log or something. This is what happens when you get a discounted price on your cheetah taxidermy job. At least he'll make a sturdy bench for someone. Number 5. Zombie Ferret And you thought for sure this thing was dead after you stuffed it. Well, you ought to think again because this zombie ferret is thirsty for revenge, as well as your brains. Number 4. The Pig Turkey This pig turkey was not made in a laboratory, but most likely by either a butcher or a taxidermist. Pig turkeys have been known to be put in the ovens and cooked during banquets. The carnivorous guests would enjoy a pig-flavored turkey leg once the piece is finished. But after looking through all the strange taxidermist photos, you have to wonder if this thing might go up on someone's wall instead. Number 3. He's watching you. This is actually what you might look like when you're getting to the end of the list and you wonder what's next. This monkey was made in a bizarre fashion with his eyes slightly bulging out. Number 2. Have mercy. This taxidermist got a little bit graphic during his last creation. This really seems like something out of a horror film. And number one, the rude groundhog. This groundhog is staying in his hole on February 2nd, and he really doesn't care that you have to suffer through a longer winter. 